Hey Pete here for Studio Live today. Now we've got a very small update to our instruments here in GarageBand which I wanted to take a look at here today and it appears to be our Japanese and Chinese instruments that we have the updates to. You can see that we have a new update when we go in here. We've got uh, a little two there next to the keyboard and we've got a one here next to our drums. And also if we go to sound library, we've got a two there. So the easiest way to check for any new instruments is to tap on our sound library here. And you can see I've downloaded all of the different packs that we have available here, but under Chinese traditional and Japanese traditional, we have some new instruments. So let's tap on Chinese to start with. And the way that we update this is to simply hit the update button here. So what we've got here is um, telling us that it's the Guzheng touch instrument and Guzheng keyboard sound. Um, so I'm interested to see exactly what is updated with this. Let's do it now. Now we'll go back to Japanese traditional and here we've got the uh, Koto touch instrument, Koto keyboard sound and Taiko drum touch instrument, which again, we already had here. So I'm not sure what these Updates are going to actually give us, we'll download this one as well. Let's download these and we'll come back and we'll see what changes we've actually got here. Okay, so what it seems the main changes here are is that we can now use our keyboard instrument here under more sounds and we can use the Guzheng and the Koto. Previously, we weren't able to actually use the keyboard for these. We could for some of our other world instruments, but not for these two. So now I can choose the Guzheng and go to my keyboard. Instead of having to use the Guzheng interface, which is pretty cool, but does take a little bit of the fun away from playing these instruments. The other change was to the Koto drums, and I haven't actually been able to work out, not the Koto, the Taiko drums here. I haven't been able to work out what is different about these. So if you do know, why don't you let me know? Because I can't quite work it out. The only thing I can see is there's a little two pattern here on the top one. We do get a different sound if we hit that with two fingers. So maybe that was there before, I don't know. I don't use these drums enough. Anyway, yeah, a very, very small update here in GarageBand. Uh, some better way to play some of our world instruments. If you've got comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below and I'll see you next time. Yeah.